Often when I'm getting to know a new confidential leadership consultancy business owner, the position that they represent is a, a fair amount of candor about the, the state of their vision and the state of the organization or organization's holdings that, that they are over that there's, there's a lack of clarity about that vision and about the specific gauges of function that they would like to see applied. And so there's, there's often a sense of it's doing what it's doing. Some, some things are working. Some things are not working. There's, there's many, many signals of different types. And often there's a great amount of competence uh, along a, a wide array of types of performance and and so it, it's uh, an interesting and, and enjoyable part in that initial phase to arrive in a, at an assessment you you really can't apply transformative vision without seeing what's happening and we can't be everywhere paper metrics pnls different types of reporting give amounts of data but there still is a necessity to translate these things into a vision overview that connects with strategic planning, but does not get lost in paper and does not get lost in assignment to subordinate directors throughout organizations. And so to vitalize that visionary capability and the actual carry out so that there's a legitimacy of the agenda of vision rolling in a way that a living pulse can be maintained and adjustments can be carried out that have actual meaning to the bottom line in performance, to the merit of operation, to quality control and everything that may be involved in comprehending the quality of how that organization or set of organizations is performing. The peace of mind that comes of this kind of next level competence in vision dynamics and in the carry out of purpose is amazingly worthy and valuable. At the same time, the advance of vision consultancy has to fit into schedules that are dynamic and that involve pressures of a wide array of types. Executive Command Dynamics is built upon a very, very simple precept. And that is, if there's a will, there's a way. There's a reason why purpose arises and for the services that organizations prepare and offer to clientele, to guests, to customers. The next step is to coordinate the fulfillment of that vision so that leadership plays a role that is connected in a very dynamic, very fulfilling, very successful manner that can only be done with this kind of focus on the detail of these command dynamics. I'm Guy Masterson, troubleshooter for XCOM, short name for Executive Command Dynamics.